It's kind of a classic side. Take it from someone who knows your brother is definitely a geek. was really neat. We're studying the life cycle of the Colombian tree toad. Someday I'd like to live among them and learn their peaceful ways. <laughs> and after chess club, the guys and I went down to CompuHut and watched them unpack the latest mouse pads. They're really neat, though. Whoopsie daisy. Geek, 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 geek. It's true. It's true. Is it something I said? Oh, brother. Enter, if you dare. Hey, Vince, check it out. I just beat myself at three-dimensional chess. Chad, can we talk? Sure, what's on your mind? I really don't know how to say this, but I've just been noticing that... Well, that you're a geek. Yeah, so? You mean you know you're a geek? Oh, sure. Ever since first grade when I bought my pet earthworm to show and tell and everybody laughed. But I always thought you were so cool. You have all these CDs and... Geek music. Andrew Lloyd Webber, Sondheim, Gilbert and Sullivan. But you always did cool stuff. And you always knew everything. And you always... Sorry, Vince, but I am what I am. And the fact is, I'm a geek. Ooh, here comes Freddy's message. Hey, can we talk later, Vince? We started our own chat room. <laughs> Neato, huh? <laughs> Hey, come on, Vince. It's not the end of the world. But Chad's a geek. Big deal. He's still your brother. I know, I know. It's just all these years I thought Chad was so cool. And now that I know he's not, it just makes me question everything. I mean, heck, if he's a geek, maybe I'm a geek. Maybe my whole life's been a sham. Oh, come on, Vince. You're talking crazy. Am I? I can see it all now. It'll start small. One of these days, I'll be walking along, minding my own business, and stuff that will catch my eye. I'll be having strange cravings for polyester pants and orthopedic shoes. Saying words like whoopsie daisy and neato. Before you know it, I'll be playing cauldrons and caverns, learning stupid yo-yo tricks, and sneaking into sci-fi conventions in my spare time. And then one night, when the moon is full... That's not the way things are going to be. Maybe and maybe not. But if this geek thing's hereditary, then I'm a walking time bomb. <sighs> Man, things can't get any worse than this. That's the kid's side. The guy in front who thinks he's so cool. So, you've been giving my little brother a hard time, eh? Hey, look, I think this is just a big misunderstanding. Yeah, you misunderstanding that you do not mess with the Kowalski family. Ever! Ooh. Hey! Leave those kids alone. Save yourself, Chad. I can only hold him back so long. It's okay, Vince. I can handle it. Stay out of this geek waiter. You're next. You heard me, Cy. Leave those kids alone. And if I don't? If you don't, you can just forget about me helping you with your math homework anymore. But, well, we're starting algebra soon. Don't take that from him, Cy. He's just a big geek. Shut up, Chucko. This guy's not kidding around. Look, Chad, we're sorry. It was just a, a, a big misunderstanding. We didn't mean nothing bad. Honest. Yeah! Chad, that was so cool. Hey, just because I'm a geek doesn't mean I'm not a cool geek. Come on, I'll give you a ride home in the old Chadmobile. See you later, guys. I'm going home with my big brother, Chad. Hey, Chad, do that thing you do. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> 